What up, peeps? Welcome to today's vlog. It is Friday, and we got some big stuff going on today. We have our glass case delivery, and unfortunately, it's raining. I don't know if you can see, it's but it sunshine. sucks. But this is the first big order that we placed was for the glass cases, and it's the last one to arrive. Everything else has already been delivered, so um, hopefully nothing gets ruined because of the rain, and hopefully we can fit everything there's 24 cabinets and slat wall. Maybe some other stuff I'm forgetting. You ready? Yeah. It's also just the two of us in the rain. It'll take like 20 minutes. It has been very, very busy today so far, which is really, really awesome to see. Um, since we've opened seven days a week, our customers are no longer forced to shop here only five out of those seven days. So it's kind of been spread out a little bit more. People that used to come on a Thursday can now come on Tuesday or Wednesday, for example. So uh, <clears throat> we've had we've had some days that have felt really, really slow, but I think it's partly because it's kind of getting warmer outside. People are spending less time indoors, but also having those extra two days to be open is spreading the customers out a little bit more. But today, Friday has been really, really good so far. We've had some really awesome trade-ins, lots of Pokemon games, which is cool. And uh, sales have been really, really good so far. So I'm excited. No, Bobby. Oh, hey, how's it going? 39 minutes. 39 minutes? Oh, is that how far away is? Yep. Nice. So we'll leave here pretty soon. Heck yeah, field trip. And Colton, I don't think we filmed your new friend. Friend? Yesterday. Friend. I have a friend. Yeah, your new friend. I don't think we filmed him. Is it Chucky? Chucky. <laughs> oh. Colton's new little buddy. I don't, I don't particularly like Chucky as a character or as a movie. <laughs> wow. See, our, our names both start with C. And that's... that's why you and I are friends. What's the difference? <laughs> Sorry, that's a bad news for you, dude. <laughs> Colt's like, I'm changing my name. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be friends with anybody who starts with the letter C. What's your middle name again? Yeah, yeah. what's your middle name, Colton? <laughs> well, why don't I just tell you my, 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 my mother's maiden name, my social security number, and everything while I'm at it. Is that what you want to know? Mine's so you could steal my $5 that I have in my account right now? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously though, what is your social? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't explain it, but the Chucky Standy, um, we ordered a bunch of them from a place in the UK and they're all officially licensed. And the Chucky one was just the only one that I put together and we're displaying it right here. The rest of them we took to the new store. They're still in their boxes, but we're going to have all these, all these officially licensed uh, life-size displays. There's some half-size ones like the Chucky one and like the Gremlins and stuff, but then there's full-size ones like Darth Vader and some X-Men and stuff. So they're going to be on display in our Blockbuster section at the new store. They're also going to be available for sale though. Uh, we're not going to be shipping them because they're too big, but they will be available. So if you're into that stuff, make sure you come and check it out once we open. Got a staff pick. It's one of my favorite games from my childhood. It is Gran Turismo 2. That's my favorite out of all the Gran Turismos. Uh, I'm sure there's better ones, but that one's just got a special spot in my heart. Um, if you don't know Gran Turismo, it's a, uh, like a a simu like a racing simulation game. So it's like they try to be as realistic as they can, but you know, on the PS1, they couldn't get too realistic. But for the era, it was actually very you know, nicely made and us like, kids like we're like, oh man, it's like real life. It's like an actual car. <laughs> but of course it looks horrible now. <laughs> but uh, I just love that game. I don't know why it's my favorite out of all of them, um, but it's just so good. I love like just collecting cars and I like racing, you know, and modifying cars like tuning them up, make them faster, and win a race real easy because I tuned it real good, you know? It makes you make feel smart when I'm not being smart at all. <laughs> it's just all mechanics in the game. But uh, if you like cars, you like racing games, really give it a try because it is one of the classics. You can't beat it, at least for me. I love it. 
you could probably play one of the later ones and you know enjoy it more but i think you should start with number two that's the best one and that's my staff pick peace <laughs> this is totally not abby from the future going back and filming trades for this video so we forgot to film some trades and I'm gonna show you stuff. And then there's stuff I can't show you, but I'm gonna show it to you anyways. But there it is. That's what you guys get to see until the next video. So starting off, we got some manuals. This Robopon 2, this is the ring version. It is in poor condition, so it's been marked down. Got some black box, black cart, black box. I don't remember what they're called, but the original like NES set from the very beginning. Wait, I feel like I've filmed these before. I might have filmed this part. I'm so sorry if I have. Mario Party 2, Pokemon Stadium 2, Paperboy 2, lots of twos in there. Ken Griffey, Super Mario Maker, got Shenmue and Doom complete in box. Sanix, a zapper gun, got two Amoebies, Amoeblets, got some Swatch games, and then we have these, which are limited run uh, ones. This is like a color variant for packs, I think. Um, also some Japanese N64 games complete in box. That one doesn't have a manual, so not complete in box. This collector's edition that Colton wanted to buy and changed his mind on. And some N64 titles. Shadow Man. Also got Rayman 2 in. Mario Galaxy. Another copy of Helldivers. Some Pokemon games right there. Some more Pokemon games. NES titles, of course, of course. Castlevania gun and PS4 titles, and of course, classic Wii Sports. What are you doing? Are you bringing a box back here? Not here. Okay. We didn't see Colton or anything. NES games. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and some DVDs. And then we have these as well. I already showed these. My bad. You can see them again, though. And we have Sega CD games. So as you can see, I put little notes on them when I'm doing trade-ins, and these tags are not ours. Those will get removed. They're from the previous owner. Case is broken, so we'll replace that Echo. The Dolphin case. And then we also got these two. I really want to show you guys these because I hope somebody will be interested. This is from Colton's personal collection, and these are the Barnes & Noble exclusive color um, Persona 5 manga artwork so the artwork was exclusive barnes and noble this is one this is three he never got volume two super duper cool i try my best to mark them down just a little bit because they are expensive because they're exclusives but please somebody get these so they go to a good home and then all of this stuff will be shown in the next video bye i don't think it's all gonna fit Oh my god. Scary. <laughs> Scary factor level 10. So we're part way through, how do you feel? I feel like a million bucks. <laughs> we are both sweaty and hot. Thank God it stopped raining. That would've made everything 10 times worse. There's a couple pieces right there that Bobby was like, I'm not carrying those all the way back right now. The rest we've been putting in the kitchen. There's no lights in here, so hopefully you guys can see. Oh yeah. So we got all this stacked up and then there's all this. <sighs> There's quite a bit, but God, my freaking hands hurt, my wrists hurt, my all my muscles are all tight, getting swole. <sighs> but there's still so much more. So the very nice guy who delivered this stuff has been helping us unload, as you guys have seen. He has his wife or someone with him. I assume it's his wife, 
and uh, I think just a kind of a traveling partner. And we're all getting hungry, we're all getting tired, so I offered to buy their lunch for them. So they're eating at Kenji's right now. And Bobby and I need to go get some sort of metal cutter thing. All of the, all the glass cases are attached to the pallets with these metal straps. And we don't really have anything to cut them. We were using like a knife and like a pair of needle nose pliers that have like a little thing that's like wire cutter, but it's, it's not doing it. So we're gonna run to the store and grab something to get those cut and uh, we'll continue on after they enjoy their lunch. And I hope that they enjoy, because Kenji's is really freaking good. And who doesn't want free lunch? Now the pod is full. We're, we can't fit another one, unfortunately. But look at all those glass cases. I hope Abby filmed trades for you guys because it is already past seven. And so we're gonna go to Kenji's, uh, Bobby, Abby, and I. Colton didn't wanna come or he couldn't come, whatever it was. So it'll just be the three of us, but she's on her way. Hope she filmed trades. And uh, so yeah, that whatever you saw already was all the game store footage that you're getting for this vlog. <laughs> and I don't think we're gonna do a question of the day because we're too tired. So I'll show you guys what we get at Kenji's, but other than that, that's pretty much it, right? Yeah. My feet really hurt. Yeah, my forearm for some reason is the most sore. The heels of my feet, uh, freaking sore. But luckily for me, not for Bobby, but luckily for me, tomorrow is my weekend. <laughs> I think it's my Wednesday. Yeah, it's my Wednesday. <laughs> Bobby has a few more days till he can relax. But I think we did good work today. <laughs> yeah. And then Wednesday, this next coming Wednesday, which is Bobby's Monday, we're going to be back here to get these glass cases off of those pallets and into our kitchen. And all of this slat wall moved somewhere else. I don't know where it's supposed to go. Maybe we'll put it in the bathroom. <laughs> Who knows? But we'll figure it out. They brought us these tasty balls because the kitchen made some extra so they gave it to us. Abby got this salad thing and we had these delicious things too, right? But now we have real food coming. They don't have poke bowls right now so I got ramen. Abby also got a ramen and Bobby got the teriyaki chicken. Yeah, we're gonna eat. Oh, so good. <laughs> 